Hi everyone, I am Vikas. Welcome back to my channel Info More Box. Today I am going to discuss more about studio lights of Sonia brand. The model number of this light is 300D Premium. So this particular product comes in combo kit where you can find two pieces of Sonia 300D Premium lights and uh, two light stand. The model number of the light stand is LS250 and the maximum height of this light stand is 9 feet and there is a studio flash trigger also. The model name is AT16 and this trigger AT16 is used to connect studio lights with camera. You can connect by using wireless signals. If you use this transmitter to attach the hot shoe of camera and you can plug in this receiver into the studio lights. If you buy this studio light flash kit from Amazon then it will cost you 11,800 rupees. If you buy from the soniaphoto.com website then it will cost you uh, somewhat around 10,800. If you buy this kit from any retail store outlet in Delhi then you will get more 10 to 20 percent discount also. All the buying links are mentioned in the description box. Please see this video till the end so that you will find all the details about this lights. If you still not subscribe my channel then please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so that you will receive camera accessories updates in future also. So now start with unboxing of this product. Let's see what's in the box. Recycling time of this flashlight is 0.2 second and it support an input voltage of 220 volt. The content of box is 300D premium light 2 piece, short box 60x60 60 60 cm 2 piece, AC power cord 2 piece, soft box ring 2 pieces, synchro cord 2 piece, light stand 2 pieces, radio trigger 8016 2 pieces and one bag for light stand. Shortbox sticks for shortbox installation. This is Sonia 300D light. Button on the back side of the light, power plug. Red button is for power, yellow button is for bulb and green button is for slave and red button is for testing. Here you can plug in power cable. Hot shoe is mount for light stand. Remove the cap by unlocking it. Flash output is 125 joules which is approximately 250 watt and modeling lamp is of 100 watt in this way you can put the cap and lock it now powering on the light by pressing the red button Bulb is on by pressing yellow button. The flashlight can check by pressing the testing red button which is in circle shape. Next we install a short box on the light with the help of a short box ring and its four rods. This is a short box ring with four holes. This is a silver black color short box for soft lightning solution. This is a white diffuser cloth to remove the harsh light on subject. This is a synchronization for connecting other devices. Here you can also put the studio flash receiver. Yeah.
we are assembling the rods of sort box in the hole of one rod we can connect another one all four sticks can be assembled in the same way upon opening the sort box you can see the velcro tape are attached to it you can insert the rods in the four black caps and which is attached to its corner see how you can put the rods in a sort box ring keep the sort box ring slightly out of the sort box insert the first rod into the hole of sort box ring and set the sort box ring properly place the rod inside of the black cap set the ring properly inside the sort box again put the next rod on the opposite side of the first rod apply a little more force to put inside the black cap third and fourth rod can also be attached in the same way see how it looks after assembling next we will see a 8016 studio flash trigger see the manual for this trigger This is the trigger now we mount it on the camera Now we fix on the hot shoe of the camera and tighten it properly Place the light in the sort box and lock it properly now we can again check by pressing the different buttons on the back side of the light now we are putting light on the stand next we will attach the diffuser cloth to the sort box properly fix it by using its velcro paste it well on all four corners see how it looks after assembling bringing another light within the opposite direction Next we are attaching receiver to light Various cable connections and sockets are attached to the receiver Insert the power cable into the receiver and plug the receiver into the light Press the power button which is in red color and there is a green light on the trigger the camera is being turned on plug the wire into the synchronization point 
mount the camera on tripod place the trigger and receiver channel setting on the bottom we'll take a picture of trigger box for a sample next trigger does not to attach to the another light for a product shoot you can set it to slave mode by pressing the green button result is a properly exposed picture when the picture is clicked This is all about studio setup by using 300D premium light. If you yet not subscribe my channel then please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so that you will receive camera accessories updates in future also. Thanks for watching this video.